You guys welcome back to my channel. So every time, which there has been quite a few instances already where uh, Dreamcatcher releases a song that has a French title. Well, at least there's like usage of French in the songs, like Déjà Vu, Ma Maison, right? Here, Bon Voyage. And I'm starting to believe that they really like French. And as a French person, that makes me incredibly excited because somehow I feel more invested in the song for whatever reason. It's kind of like how you're gonna, you know, hook me in. And here I am. So I guess that works. So that's the first thing that's exciting. The second thing that is exciting is I wonder how this time around they're gonna they're gonna make me think because they always make me think somehow because like bon voyage is like have a nice trip right have a nice journey considering their past concepts etc does that mean that they're leaving earth because there's no saving it anymore because we fucked it up so bad and so now we have to go to another planet or something and so they're like bon voyage like have a nice trip which in itself is not so far-fetched because people are already looking into you know going to mars etc trying to find another habitable uh planet because apparently it's easier to look somewhere else than to try and fix what we have here yep anyways uh english captions are on bon voyage let's go Wow. Wow. <laughs> okay. Interesting. <laughs> what the hell is that? Gorgeous. Is that sign language? But they just did. That's a nice pronunciation. What kind of tarot card was that? This part is like so like a warm embrace and right here It feels like they're saying I will fight for us That is 
I'm feeling very differently about this comeback compared to many of their past comebacks. There is a delicate feeling about this one right here. I think I've got a nice way to maybe explain what I'm feeling about this song. You know how you look at like the red thread of, uh, of fate that, you know, unite people? If you believe in fate and destiny and whatnot, you know, when you look at the thread, it looks like it would snap really easily because of how small and, and thin it looks. And so that's where I get the delicate feeling from this song. But actually this thread is incredibly solid and it would take so much to break it and snap it. When they say like, even if I leave, like every cell is drawn to you still. Even if we're still apart, we're together. It's almost like, I don't know if I understand correctly, but it, what I get from this is like, maybe because they love someone so much, they want to protect them. So they are trying to leave, but still they know that they love each other. Is this a standalone or is it still part of the concept? I love her voice right here. There's that, it's so melodic, nostalgic, delicate. Like when they sing it like this, it almost feels like they're like being vulnerable in like the true feeling. And it's so, like the verses are my favorite part. Like they're so, so, so gorgeous. The guitar and just their voices, beautiful. Yeah, that's beautiful. Beautiful. That's fantastic, holy shit. This is such a good comeback in song. It might not be as potent, quote unquote, as their previous few comebacks it's less like powerful and in your face for sure i think sometimes there's strength in vulnerability there's something that is very powerful in like delicate things you know that's that's why i use you know the example of a thread before because it looks very easy to snap but it's really solid you know it might look delicate but it's actually really strong is what it is and this is what this song is giving me also this part right here i'm not even gonna lie to you i said this almost every time but there's always a little something that makes that reminds me of 80s yeah right there the whole halazia thing yeah that's why i'm asking whether this actually like is part of the the whole concept or or if this is just standalone comeback i haven't read that it was standalone though i'm curious well we're still in a destroyed world so yeah anyways if anyone knows what this little fluffy thing i don't know what it does but i guess if there's like walking along them is trustworthy? I don't know. What I know is that I really enjoyed the song. I really liked it even. And I can easily see myself come to love it really fast. So I have to say there's like that one track on the album, which, dude, I don't even remember the name of it. No, this one. This. It sounds like I feel it in my soul. I'm really curious about this song. It sounds amazing. I think I'm gonna love this song a lot, lot, lot. So yeah, anyways, uh, I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. I know, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.